locally known as the Panch Pandav Rats. The Panch Rats of Mahabalipuram are considered to be the pinnacle of Dravidian monolithic architecture. They hold an important place in terms of architectural history as they mark the point of transition between the earlier tradition of rock-carved temples and the later tradition of freestanding stone structures. These monolithic temples of Mahabalipuram are situated on the Coromandel coast of the Bay of Bengal near Chennai in the state of Tamil Nadu. These Pancharats, meaning five chariots in Sanskrit, are attributed to the Pallav king Narasimha Varman I, who was popularly known as Mamala, and date back to the 7th century. These five structures are each chiseled in the shape of chariots out of a large monolith granite. Named after the five Pandav brothers and Draupadi, their wife, they are known as the Dharmaraj Rath, the Bhim Rath, the Arjun Rath, the Nakul Sehadev Rath and the Draupadi Rath. Apart from these five structures, the complex also houses statues of a lion, bull and elephant. The vimans of these structures are marked by the presence of shalas, kutas and chandrashila which are all typical features of the Pallav architecture. The smallest of all the ruts is the Draupadi Rath. It is a simple chariot having a single cell and is dedicated to Goddess Durga. This rath is shaped like a thatched hut and has a square roof. The adjoining Arjun Rath shares the platform with this rath. The base is raised and adorned with figures of lions and elephants. Here, Durga is seen on the lotus pedestal. She is surrounded by other characters including a man who is preparing to cut his head off as a sign of devotion. A stylistically carved sea monster can be spotted above the entrance door. The eastern wall of this rak has a sculpture of Durga standing on the head of Mahishasur. The Dharmaraj Rath and the Arjun Rath are seen representing the South Indian temple architecture in its initial stages. The Arjun Rath is devoted to Shiva. It is shaped like a small wooden shrine. It faces towards the east and has two stories, a small portico and carved pillars. In contrast to its interiors, the exterior of this rath is richly carved. The facade has magnificent carved sculptures showing gods and humans side by side. A pair of apsaras can be seen on its exterior wall. The Dharmaraj Rath is the tallest and has a three-storied temple with an octagonal shikha and garbhagriha in each story. This contains an inscription in Pallav Granth script which says that King Narasimha Varman I built the Dharmaraj Rath for the pilgrims who visited this town in 1630 CE. It has a small square hole in the centre with pillared verandas below and a pyramidical pinnacle above. This Rath is devoted to Indra and is associated with elephants. The roof of this Rath has the shape of an elephant's back. The lion pillars are seen to be adorned with shalas and kudus. Sculptures of Harihar, Brahma, Subramanya, Narasimha Pallav and Ardhanarishwar can be spotted on its outside walls. The longest of all the Raths is the Bhim Rath. It is a Gopura style temple with three stories and a gable roof. This Rath is shaped like a Viman which is a crucial characteristic of the South Indian temple architecture. Said to be devoted to Anantashayi Vishnu, the larger size of this Rath can be explained by a large bar relief of the Shayana Murti of Vishnu inside. The sanctuary of this structure has a circumambulatory passage around it. Pillars of the shrine are adorned with figures of lions. The Nakul Sehadev Rath is absidal in form. This Rath is referred to as the Gaj Prisht, meaning elephant back in Sanskrit. Immediately beside this Rath, there is an image of an elephant. A UNESCO World Heritage Site maintained under the patronage of the Archaeological Survey of India 
This complex laid the foundation of a distinctive architectural style in South India.